Here I see Pep Van in the corner through everybody out in full force tonight as it's the conference opener in Atlantic Hockey for the RIT Tigers. The top power play unit back on the ice here for the RIT Tigers. Shot going wide. Behind the net. Mitchell. Backhand red! And a Mitchell with the backhand. The Tigers on the power play. They won the. I think that time, the line didn't locate Mitchell. Shumway. Long pass. Here's Mitchell. Mitchell, the shot. And the goal! Second tonight for Adam Mitchell. Who got blasted afterwards and went right into the boards. Boy, another quick shot there by Mitchell. Wow, impressive tonight. I think it's a keeper, John. Now here's the big wind-up. Ruby the save and trying to glove it out of the air was Wido. Couldn't get it down. Puck remains in the Tiger end. Robert Morris will send it in. It's a goal from way out. A lot of traffic in front. Brace. Two to one. That goal comes at 11.30 here in the second, so it's back to a one goal game. No, it's not. We are now tied. That shot let go by Colin South, and just like that, the Tiger lead evaporates. Putting the pressure on, getting some puck movement there. And Robert Morris has come alive. And now the Colonials with Saraceno dropping back. In front, another goal, and the Tigers here. Jacqueline putting that one in. It's now 3-2 Colonials. Didn't rotate back the Tigers. Not as quick getting back as they've been and left the backside wide open. And they go to the puck, but nobody's getting back. And there you go. There you go. Jacqueline gets clear lane there. 102 remaining in the Tiger power play. Hamburg going for the draw here. Tigers coming up with it. Shumway keeps it in. Dakota will send it down low to Hamburg. Hamburg is in! He shot it to the net! Anthony Hamburg with his first goal as an RIT Tiger. And the Tigers on the power play have tied it at three. Somehow, I don't even know how that found the net. Looked like he had no angle whatsoever. Went off the skate, bounced in off the off the line. Yeah, let's get a good look at it. That's just a soft goal, John. No, that's about as soft <laughs> as it gets. Levine here, that save to get his head back into it as Mitchell. Centering it in front. Oh, that beautiful back feed. And Dakota back hands it in off the back of Levine. Nolan Dakota strikes for three. All right, team. The more I see of this number three, Alexander Kukali, the more I'm liking this defensive player, and they're giving him some quality ice time. Shot goes behind the net. As it's a goal. How did that one get in? We are tied at four. I have to take another look at this one. I believe it was South. We'll wait and see, John. That's when you think Roberts is done. We're not done, but the Tigers are in control. There we go. That puck got loose out front. Mm. Okay, it goes behind the net. Okay. And then there's the shot. And then, oh, sliding across. Holding it in, Garbowski not able to. Here's Hervano on a break. Zach Hervano going in, drop pass, and the goal! Jeff Jones has given Robert Morris the 5-4 advantage. With a five on three, disadvantage Garbowski. So really, the Tigers have no choice but to send Jordan Ruby back out onto the ice with a face off back in their end. Ruby will hold on. Well, no, he won't. He'll be put back in. Ruby was going down in a five on three goal, and that will seal it as that's number 14, Zach Hervato on the power play. 6 4 is the score here tonight.